Hey everybody, welcome back to Samsung in a Minute, the channel that trains you on your Samsung Galaxy devices in around two minutes. Today we're going to talk about five hidden features built inside of the Galaxy S Pen for your Galaxy Note 20 and the Note 20 Ultra. Now you will also notice that this will work with past Galaxy Note phones. Now because we are covering five hidden features, we're going to bang through these pretty quick here on Samsung in a Minute. Now this first one is a way that you're able to open up your quick note really fast and it's a little bit more efficient. So the first way is by going inside of your air command, then opening up create note, unless if you go inside of your Samsung notes and you do it there, but there's a hidden way that you can open this up. Press and hold on that S Pen button, double tap the screen, and then now you're off to the races, very easy, convenient, and then now you're able to create your notes. Now, the moment that you hit on that X button on the very top, now the nice thing about closing out of it is that it will automatically be stored inside of your Samsung Notes sitting right here. Now, this next hidden feature is a way that you're able to unlock your Galaxy phone with just the press of the S Pen button. So once you go inside of the settings, you wanna go inside of your advanced features, now underneath advanced features, go inside of S Pen, and this is where you wanna choose the option of S Pen Unlock. Now it will take the security of your phone down just a little bit because that means that anybody who is around your phone and if your S Pen is still out, they will be able to unlock it just by hitting that button. So if you have a pin, type it in. Now, once you've typed in your credentials, what we're gonna do is let's say that you had your phone basically time out. So if you're trying to unlock your phone, the very first time that you hit on this S Pen button, it's trying to unlock, it will not let you do it the very first time. It's basically making sure that you're still there. So then this way you're able to unlock your phone. So that means that the next time that your phone times out or if you hit your little power button, when you hit on the S Pen button, it will unlock for you automatically because it knows that your S Pen is out, which means you're probably coming right back just to use it again. Now these next hidden features is when you are inside of Samsung Notes. Let's say that we go right inside of here and we wanted to uh, add on to this little note. This first one is how you're able to change your favorite pens. So if you went down over here and you added in some of your favorite pens inside of here, so you got that red one, you have a highlighter, a white uh, little pencil right there. So if you had anything that was already saved, instead of you going through and, and manually changing it, you can actually go through and have it being changed just by hitting the S Pen button. Now this next hidden feature is a way that you're able to use your eraser without having to use that eraser icon. So what you're able to do is, let's say that we go through and I add in a couple more lines. What you wanna do is give a double press, it moves it right over inside of the eraser, give it another double press, and then now you're right back inside of creating your notes. Now this last hidden feature is what happens when you do a press and hold of the S Pen button. So what application pops up? So how you're able to customize this is you wanna go right inside of your settings on the top right hand side, scroll down to where it says advanced features. Now inside of advanced features, click on S Pen, and this is where you wanna go inside of air actions. And this is where it says right here, hold down button two, and then you're able to choose what you want it to do. So you can have it open up notes if you want to. Maybe there's an application that you use all the time. So let's go inside of YouTube. So now what's gonna happen is what happens when I do a press and hold. Now it's gonna open up YouTube. Now the cool thing about this one is that it'll happen really no matter what you're using. So let's say that we go, uh, let's go inside of every day and let's head over inside of Twitter. Now let's say that we're already using this one right here. And if we do a press and hold, it's gonna open up whatever shortcut it is so it doesn't matter if you're on the home screen or a different application it will pull up whatever you have set up for the press and hold now if you forgot what that very first one was it went really quick it's a way that you're able to open up your quick notes really fast just do a press and hold double tap the screen and there is your notes again super efficient and very fast now i hope you guys have liked this video if you guys did please give this thing a huge thumbs up don't forget to hit on subscribe subscribe right over here on the very bottom left hand side and if you like this video, then more than likely you'll also like this video. And I'll see you guys later. I got tons of soul on my true collective ball. Famous, so, so famous, number one, desirable. I do what I want, when I want, and how I want it. Leave you with the one in the air, that's how I want. I got tons of soul on my true collective ball. Famous, so, so famous, number one, desirable.